Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android Guy. Hey guys, I have something on my face. It's the Gear VR, and today we're going to be showing you how a walkthrough of the Gear VR and how to navigate through it. So, this will be how to navigate through the Gear VR. As you can see, you kind of get an idea of what I'm looking at right over here. Um, I'm actually seeing one image, but when we mirror it to our TV, it's showing two images. So, we're going to take a look at this, and just so you can see, there's two navigation buttons right on the side over here. And there's one that's a back button right here, and there's one that's touchpad. And this touchpad is used for uh, basic movement through um, parts of the app itself. So, uh, when you first launch this, uh, you are at the home. You're at the home section. To your left is where you can get apps. So we have the Samsung Gear uh, Samsung store, and then we have the Oculus store. So um, right here we can kind of tap. So you tap the button to select. And we can see all of the different apps that are available to us. And so it will load all of the apps, and then you can swipe over just to see them. and you can see through it. Now, you tap it to select it, and from here you can tap to see more. So we can see a summary of how this is. And go back, and then see the details, what controls does he use, does he use head tracking and touchpad, or does he use the gaming controller. And to see media, to see how this plays out and what you need to do when you're in here. So, pretty simple. And then even updates, updates that uh, the person has uh, done to the app itself. Oops, I think we clicked on one app. There we go. And we're gonna go back, and then so you can see, this is again the, uh, the home. So that was the store, and that's where you're gonna get new apps and you know uh, be able to download more. Over here we have the library. Now if you're wondering what's in front, well that's all the recent things I've done. So all of the recent uh, things that I've viewed are right here on the middle. So these are all my kind of recent apps. And then over here is the library. Now again, the library you can swipe to see all of your collection, everything that you've installed. And then you can even click on all to see things that might not be installed yet and that you need to install. <coughs> Sorry guys, still fighting a little cough. Um, and this is how you navigate through it again, just left and right, basic function. Now, besides this, there's also one other thing you can do, and that is hold down the back button. So if you hold down the back button at any time, you get uh, brought up to this special menu. Now, in this menu, you can see the uh, battery percentage you currently are at. Wi-Fi, the time, and including like data, Bluetooth, and that kind of stuff. So over here at the bottom, we have a bunch of different icons. We have a total of six icons. The first one is just going back to the Oculus Home. The second one is a pass-through camera. So if I go right, if I hit this button, I can actually pass through and now see you guys. So now I'm seeing the TV and I'm seeing over here um, and everything that it's seeing through. So I'm seeing the camera itself. Now I can hit back. And now I'm back here again. So, but that's so if you ever just need to see through and it uses your camera on your Note 4 to see through. Then you can reorient so that, you know, wherever I'm currently facing will be the center then for it. I can turn Do Not Disturb on on my phone, so that way I won't get interrupted by calls or text messages or anything such as that. You can turn the brightness up or down, and you can turn the comfort mode on. Comfort mode is basically a less amplified colors. They're not white. They're more uh, um, a, a tannish tone, so it's not as invasive against your eyes. And those are all the functions, guys. So that's the basic navigation of how to get apps, how to uh, view them where they are, and then how to walk through everything on the Gear VR. 
Hopefully you did like this video. If you did, please give a like, thumbs up down below. And if you have any questions on the Gear VR, feel free to ask. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android Guy.